Open Mind Technologies supply Hypermill CAD CAM software, so we've travelled to Procut to find out why they've invested in this technology. Steve, as a company having five Herco machines, I know that you love the control panel and actually programming at the machine. So what was the main reason to why you purchased Hypermill software? Well, there, there was various reasons, to be honest, but I would probably say the main reason is parts are getting a lot more complicated and complex to, to, to manufacture. And the, the control is brilliant, but I do feel it has its limitations. So moving over to... Hypermill just opens a lot of extra doors with the collision testing that it offers. It's got trochoidal milling for roughing cycles. It's much safer. It's much, much safer, faster. We'd just come to the end of the road with the current CAD CAM that we had, and we just needed something a little bit more, which Hypermill definitely offers. You talk about these CAM cycles, you said about the trochoidal milling. What areas of this are going to help you? They offer lots of different roughing cycles. So as opposed to a traditional roughing cycle where you take it in, in steps but use a bigger diameter of the cutter, with trochoidal milling you use more of the whole flute length and a percentage of the cutter. So you get much better tool life, you can run the cutters much faster and it reduces roughing time as well. So do you think using the new software the whole machining process is faster? I, I, I would say so, and obviously it comes with the advantage to when this machine is running on a job now, Alex is sitting in there already programming the next job, so as soon as the part comes off of this one, it's a simple case of uploading the new program into the machine, setting our coordinates, and essentially pressing go again, so there's very, very minimal downtime. So my job role here is to be the main programmer. Um, we used to program on the machines themselves, but we found that we were losing time by not being able to stay ahead of the game. Hypermill allows you to program offline, do all the programming whilst the machine is still doing a current job, and that way you can build a big queue of um, future jobs. So what have you done with Hypermill so far? Because I know you're in the very early days. Yeah, we are in the early days. I've I've literally last week, I think it was, done the training. So um, I have had a, had a little go at it, come across a few problems as to be expected, called up the technical support, and they've been able to walk me through through using the team viewer and a phone call at the same time and just fix all the little bugs and problems. So at the moment, it's, um, it's a very steep learning curve. It's a new software. So once we get, get a foot into it and know what we're doing hopefully you don't need to use them as much but they will always be there to help us when we do. So what type of work are you planning to use on Hypermill? So uh, initially we're going to just use it for simple stuff um, and then we're going to take it to using the full capacity of Hypermill which is what it's known for which is the five axis simultaneous toolpaths they can produce hopefully giving us better finishes and quicker times for the parts. And how does this software compare to previous softwares that you've used before? So previous softwares we've used, um, we've been doing five axis stuff with it, but we've been finding our collision detection hasn't been that great. So we've sort of had to lie to it to allow us to produ produce the parts. Uh, with Hypermill, that shouldn't be the case. It should indicate where the collisions are, both in an internal and an external simulation, both done on the computer. Um, and it just gives you a list of where these collisions are and it makes it so simple to correct any problems which we have. So what training have you gone on with Hypermill? So the way they do it, they do uh, a three-day course to sort of get you going, just the basics, and then a couple of weeks later they'll put another three-day course and then a couple of weeks, a two-day course. And in those courses they'll be teaching you more each time on the different features available. Um, so I've only just done the, the initial three days, so very early days for us. Did you enjoy it and what did you learn? Uh, yeah, it's very good. Yeah, it was enjoyable. It was taught very well. Um, and we done a bit on the CAD side of things, so producing a part. And then we were actually programming that part itself. Um, a bit on three axis, mostly it was three axis. 
and there was bits of five axis as well. What do you think ultimately it's going to give you if you have Hypermill within your machine shop? Confidence, I'd say. It's, um, it's known for very good collision detection. Um, with that, you can then trust that it's going to go on the machine and come out correct, basically. So what was the reason why you purchased Hypermill and how is it going to take your business forward? The main reason was we've kind of come to the end of where we can go with the current CAD CAM provider. Work's getting more complex and more complicated to make. And speaking to other people within the industry, I picked Hypermill because I just know it's the direction we need to go in. We can't get held back. We need the latest technology, basically, to move the company forward. And Hypermill, I'm sure, is definitely the right person to be doing that with.